This master shot is best used when you want to put emphasis on the specific relationship between characters other than talking because eye contact is another way to communicate your feelings towards others. This is mainly used in romantic scenes in movies. In this storyboard, reading from top left to bottom right, the boy sees his friend but the girl decides to avoid eye contact with him. The boy keeps coming closer to the girl and they take turns looking at each other while the other one is looking away. The boy and the girl then meet eye contact. For a dialogue scene that involves eye contact, it is very vital to have your characters out in the calm or quiet atmosphere so that the mood that you are trying to represent also describes the scene that is going on between characters. Visual tension is key for this shot. For most of the scene, get your actors to not look directly at each other from the start. More tension is created when the actors are avoiding eye contact with one another. The arrangement when filming the shot is also very crucial. Make sure that the actors are purportedly looking at each other and the eyes are away. The height of the camera shouldn't be an eye line angle. It should be at the height of where the person is talking. This is very similar with the reverse shot. Have your actors take turns looking at each other. This is especially important because it adds on to the tension before the characters finally make eye contact. You need to make sure that your expressions or actions clearly show what one's mind is thinking in the act. This will make it easier for the audience to understand what is going on just by looking at the eyes. Last of all, make sure that when one character is trying to make eye contact, the other character should always be framed. When your actors finally meet eye contact, this is what makes the moment complete. Some key points that you should keep in mind about this master shot is to have your actors avoid eye contact, take turns to look at each other, and remember to always frame one of your characters. Now, I'll show you my example of this master shot.